Want to keep up with the latest Komodo gaming videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Here they come. Oh, that looks just insane. All right, they're going down. Ooh, we got a really good battle for the lead here. Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of BeamNG Drive. And yes, folks, we are back once again, and today we are back with some more races. Now, it's actually been a long time since we've done these races, and I've really been wanting to bring them back. And there's a new mod here that I think you guys are going to enjoy that are going to add a little bit of style to the races here. So if you can see down here, which I have it completely uh, away from the track here, I need to actually move it over to the right. There is a custom ramp mod. Now I'm going to show you guys how this thing works. It's absolutely amazing. Uh, we are definitely going to be using this more here in the future. I just got to slide it over just a little bit over here. So we're going to be using that here today. We're going to try out a variety of races. I figure we go ahead and start off with the good old NASCARs. So we'll jump back up there here in a second. But if you guys have any suggestions for future races on the channel, comment below. And if you're enjoying BeamNG on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel. And one last thing. If I sound a little weird today, I've been coming off a sinus infection. Uh, I actually feel good, but I just don't sound the greatest right now. So I can't assure you everything's actually okay. I just sound a little funny here today. So anyways, I think we're ready to jump into this. Let's go ahead and check out this ramp. Okay, so I turned the ramp into a car. So what we're going to do here... Uh, the ramp is spawnable like any vehicle in BMG. Now, the ramp does something that's actually really, really neat. Uh, let's go and back up. I want to make sure I'm lined up correctly with the half pipe there. All right, this should be good right about here. So what we're going to do, let's go ahead and put it right here at the bottom. Uh, this should be good. So let's go into our manage and select vehicles. Now, if I go down here, you'll see adjustable ramp. Now, one cool thing that this ramp does, and I think this thing kind of actually uh, spawns itself halfway underground, so I'm assuming it's doing that to kind of keep itself stable. So, as far as the adjustability, you're going to go into the vehicle config menu, so we'll go over here, go to tuning. Now, you don't see it in real time, so you kind of have to adjust, then hit apply to see what it does. So, we'll go down here to width, and we'll go ahead and turn it to max, and boom, check this out. We got a wide ramp here. So you can change stuff like the curve. Uh, let's go ahead and put it down a little bit. Uh, you can see, actually that's the, uh, I think that's the little hook here. Hold on, let's turn that back up. So that makes it steeper. Okay, so we've got that, uh, the base width, I think that would extend just the bottom. So let's make it a little bit wider. This is actually gonna be one of the widest ramps we've ever had, and this is gonna be really good, I think, uh, for the NASCARs. I don't know if I'm still in position. I might need to move it over a little bit more. So we can also make it really uh, long, so let's go boom, there we go, uh oh, uh oh, I think we're freaking out a little bit, on, oh, let's go back, uh, apply, there we go, I think I need to move it over a tiny bit more, but you guys kind of get how this thing works, it's actually really cool, and plus, check this out, we can go ahead and change the color, so say we, we want just like a green ramp, let's go boom, and it's green. Uh, very neat mod. Hopefully we see more stuff like this coming up soon. Uh, let me position this and we'll start our first race. Alright, I think we're ready to go here. We've got seven NASCARs to start off with. Uh, go ahead and choose which number do you think is going to win. So I think to win, you have to hit the ramp. Uh, no missing it, which I think it's still a little over to the left side. I might have to adjust it once again, but we'll go ahead and try out a race here. But I say... Whoever touches the ramp first is going to be the winner. Now, I do have another car down behind the ramp. That way, they have something to chase. So, if you see two 18s, uh, that's what that is down there. So, anyways, I think we're ready to go. Let's go ahead and get a view of the start here. We're going to go AI, and here we go. Chase me. Oh, yes. Oh, the frames are actually really good. Oh, we could totally add more cars than this. Oh, here we go. Okay, let's slow it down real quick. Let's pick this apart. Looks like the uh, 41. Actually, this was a clean start. 41's got the early lead. 48-2. You got the 24 and the 18. And the 78 and 88 have wiped out. All right, let's go ahead and go down. Uh, let's go ahead and speed it back up. Real time. Here they come. Oh, look at this. The 48's coming alongside. The oh, he turned him. He turned the 41. Oh man, it really, actually I sound really weird when I get excited now because of the sickness. 
Oh, I think the two is actually going to take the lead here, though. Look at that. Oh, that is amazing. But question is, are they actually going to hit the ramp? Oh, let's position herself down here. That way we can watch the finish. All right, here they come. Oh, they got really spread out. But I think that's the... Uh, wait, yep, that's the two. Two is going to... Wait, here he comes. Yep, two, one. Wow. He actually came from behind. Where did everybody else go? Uh, I think everybody else missed the ramp. Han, do we have somebody else going to hit it? 88. Oh, he just missed it. Are you serious? Where did everybody else... Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Oh, no. Oh, so when the, uh, when the 41 and the 48 got together, yeah, they turned themselves to the side and they hit this big wall. All right, well, I think officially only one person finished. Uh, the two hit the ramp and everybody else died. That was great. The frames were great, though. I swear we can add more cars. Oh, let's make a bigger race. All right, so I've added four more NASCARs. Uh, this is actually pretty chaotic, so we're going to have 11 in total. And I don't think, you know, I really feel bad for the back row because I don't think they're going to make it anywhere. So if you're going to pick a winner from this race, I would probably suggest maybe the first or second row. You know, we're going to go with the 24 again on my end, and I'm ready to go. I hope the frames hold up here. Let's go AI and chase me. Oh, there they go. Oh, this is amazing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait. Okay, this is definitely a way more of a cluster this time. Wait, look, the 24. 24 and the 2 once again. Hold on, let's get down here. There they go. Oh, hold on, let's slow this down. Look at the chaos. Oh, the 41's launching up. 88 spinning out. I think we have a drag race down towards the bottom. Oh, look at all the other cars swarming through. Anybody flipping? Oh, here we go. The 4 is barrel rolling down. That looks amazing. All right, let's go down here. Oh, boy. Oh, it's going to be a drag race. I think the two might be in trouble, though. He's going to shoot off the ramp at an angle. Ah, the 24 might do it, too. There they go. And boom. And it is pure chaos behind him. All right, let's go down for the finish, and then we'll catch the crash. All right, here they come. Oh, the two is off course. I think that's the 24. Yep, 24. Wow, the two almost caught him there. All right, here we go. Second place is going to be 18. Third place is 12. Uh, the two missed the ramp. What the heck is this one doing? Oh, is he going to still hit the ramp? Oh, he was so close. Uh, looks like the 22 finished. And it looks like we have... What is that? Oh, that's a piece of debris. On where... Okay, that's the 55 and 41. Where was the four at? I know he was flipping. Oh, there they go. Oh, what do we have up here? I see debris coming down. Uh, waiting for another car. Oh, it's the 48 and the 4. Coming for the finish. 48's going to completely miss it here, I think. Uh, but I think the 4 possibly has a chance. Nope, I think he's going to go to the left side. Yep, they split it. That is pure chaos because look at all the dead cars out here. That is amazing. All right, so we see we could do 11. Can we do even more? We might have the biggest NASCAR race on our hands here, folks. Alrighty, so we now have 15 NASCARs spawned in. And I'm pretty sure this might be the limit before it gets bad. I don't know, I think this might be it. You know, I'm pretty sure the NASCARs take up more FPS than normal cars do. So maybe if I spawned in like 20 normal cars, maybe that's something we could do run-wise. Anyways, I think we're ready to go. Now, we do have a couple repeat numbers, but everybody has their own individual paint job uh, just because I ran out of uh, actual different numbers. Uh, but it seems to be like there's like 20 different uh, 12s in this pack. So, so you're going to see a couple of those, a couple 22s, and I even think, wait, no, it's just one, two. All right, so let's do this. All right, here we go. Biggest NASCAR race. Boom. Here they come. Oh, that looks just insane. All right, they're going down. Ooh, we got a really good battle for the lead here. On right, slow this down real quick. Uh, let's check out which numbers they are. It uh, looks like 41, 48, and 2. Yeah, that front row really does favorite those, uh, those first couple cars if they don't take themselves out. But look at this. This is amazing back here. Actually, the 21 got some major air. That's going to hurt. I'd love to be able to make a rundown with these cars, but I have to have the chase car down towards the bottom. Oh, let's go down here. We're going to do a little full speed action. 
All right, here they come. 41's got a pretty decent lead. The two and the 48 are on each other. Here come the rest, and here comes the big one. Oh, no. Oh, the 24 just launched himself. Oh, that's going to hurt. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, he's going to grind on top of the rail, and... Oh, no. Oh, no, we just broke it. We just had an explosion. Oh, dear. What are we looking at here? Yeah, sometimes the wheels and beam and G, especially on the stock car, if there's a, if there's a certain collision, they do this. Huh, and hopefully that doesn't interrupt. Actually, that's a wild card for the lead here. Look at this. The two car exploded. The 41's okay, though. All right, let's see if we can resume here. Come on. Oh, no. Uh, so I'm pretty sure a couple are about to explode and disappear. Here they come. Oh, this is ridiculous looking. Hold on, let's see if we can get down here. We have definitely broken something. Keep coming. Come on, don't crash the game. The 41 looks like he's outrunning the... Uh oh, no, he's getting hit by whatever that is. That black wall. No! Oh, this is going to be ridiculous. Let's see if we can try to see the finish here. 41 has missed its ramp completely. It's going to come down to who can touch the ramp first. All right, so we have a blob of a car right here. Which car is this? It's the 78. Here it comes. Looks like the 78 is going to win with whatever that is. There is not much car left there. Uh, anybody else going to come even close? The 12 just missed the ramp. Wow, that is... Uh, yeah, we did it, folks. We, uh, we broke it. All right, so I think 15 is the limit for the NASCARs uh, before stuff really hits the fan. I think we need to try another race. I want to see if we can get a lot of normal cars on there. All right, folks, I think we did it here. It's about to get a little bit laggy, but I said I was going to do 20 cars, and folks, I have 20 cars. We're probably going to have to do this in slow-mo uh, to have any sort of respectable frame rate, but I figured if I did all of the same color and all of the same model, it would probably help it to where I can spawn in as many as possible. And as you can see here, we have 20 AI cars. Technically, we have 21 because I have one car at the bottom of the ramp that these cars are going to chase. So let's go ahead and slow it down a little bit here. And let's just enjoy it because this is going to be just pure chaos. All right, here we go. Actually, you know what? We're going to try real time just to begin with here to see how bad it is. Let's go real time. Oh, no. Oh, that looks terrible. Oh, that is awesome and terrible at the same time. Hold on. Slow it down. Dude, look at the chaos. Oh, that is so cool. I would say, hey, let's see which car is winning, but they're all like generic white cars. So uh, this car right here is winning. Uh, let's go ahead and go down here. Uh, let's go full speed pass. That is so cool. Man, could you imagine if we could spawn in even more at like a decent frame rate? Like right here, this isn't terrible, but it isn't great. Uh, looks like on, oh, here they come. Oh, they're gonna hit this bottom ramp, but it's gonna be just awesome. Here they come, bottom ramp. Oh, they are flying right now. Oh, that is amazing. Look at the air they're getting. Actually, who's gonna win out of that? Dude, that is such insane air, huh? And where are they gonna land at is the question. Uh, let's go full speed. Oh, buddy. Oh, we got to watch them hit. Here they come. I wonder if they're all going to wind up pretty much in the same area. Here we go. Oh. Oh, that's ridiculous looking. Boom. All right, here come the others. Let's go full speed now. Oh, yes. The satisfying destruction of Beam and G. Oh, and I know we have more coming. Oh, look at this group here. This group all got tangled up together. There they go. And we still have even more coming down the hill. Is anybody else going to hit the ramp, though? Looks like everybody else is going to pretty much avoid it here. A lot of these cars have a tremendous amount of damage. Wait, this one? Oh, he's going to do it, folks. He's going for the gold. Oh, he's going to miss it. Oh, and he's going to flip himself here. Watch. Whoop. There he goes. And then look at the pile up down here. That, that was amazing. All right, so 20 is definitely the limit, and it has to be 20 of the same cars. Wow. This is just a junkyard out here. Man, I don't really know how to top that. You know, let's just run a couple funky vehicles down for the last race. 
All right, so I figure we go ahead and finish this off here with the America bus, or I think it's called the Hero bus. I'm going to run down it myself since I haven't gotten to experience the custom ramp and actually running up to it. So I've got it. I've got some cop cars behind me. Custom ramp is down at the bottom. It's as wide as it can go. I hope I can actually hit it. All right, so here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go AI. I'm going to roll a bit here and chase me. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, hold on. Let the bus touch. Okay, here we go. Oh, yes. Oh, no. This is going to be way too fast. Look at that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Engine locked up. Huh? We still have the Jado rockets. I still have steering. Oh, dear. Look how fast we're going. Uh-oh. This is going to hurt. Oh, no. Okay, folks, I think we found the limit as to how fast you can go and safely hit the ramp, and we turned the bus into mushy mess. Jeez, that was brutal, huh? The cops, did they make it? Uh, there's one. Where did the other two? Oh, here they come. Wow, it took them a long time to get down on. Oh, this one's gonna hit the ramp. Cops going in for some style points. Oh, that was backwards, too. Boom. Wow. Well, uh, I guess they could come out here to the bus that is in flames. Oh, it just exploded. That was incredible. Yeah, that, uh, I guess we hit the ramp too hard. The ramp does put itself somewhat down into the ground, but yeah, I think we were going about 350 by the time we hit it, and it just could not take it at all. Still pretty amazing. Pretty satisfied with that closing. But anyways, folks, uh, thank you guys for all the love and support on the BeamNG series. You guys are absolutely amazing. Uh, I do apologize for the way I sound, but there's not really much I can do about that. Uh, hopefully within the next coming days, uh, it'll get a lot better. But yeah, thank you guys for all the love and support, and we will see you guys next time in BeamNG.